Galatians chapter 3 verses 26 to 29. All of you who have been baptized have clothed yourself with Christ, for through faith, you are all children of God in Christ Jesus. For all of you who were baptized into Christ have clothed yourselves with Christ. There is neither Jew nor Greek, there is neither slave nor free person, there is not male and female, for you are all one in Christ Jesus. And if you belong to Christ, then you are Abraham's descendant, heirs according to the promise. Verse 28 tells us, There is neither Jew nor Greek, there is neither slave nor free person, there is not male and female, for you are all one in Christ Jesus. In biblical times it was common for Jewish men to begin their day with this prayer. Lord, I thank you that I am not a Gentile, a slave or a woman. When you think of the temple you see the same concept the, court of the Gentiles, then the court of the women, the court of the men, priests, and the holy of holies where God would reside. As your status increased so did your closeness to God. From God's perspective, no one is more privileged or superior to anyone else. When we allow our differences to separate us, and prevent us from reaching certain people, or groups with the gospel, then we are opposing God not assisting Him. It is our natural inclination to feel uncomfortable around people who are different than us, it shouldn't be that way in church or anywhere else. The challenge for every local church is to be inclusive of every race and color that is represented in its community. Emphasizing one ethnic group makes the church irrelevant to other people and groups. Such a church only builds walls as it will get deeper and deeper into its own culture instead of building bridges to draw in the rest of the community. God's intention and plan is for the local church to be multicultural. We are baptized into one body, baptism incorporates the Christian into the risen, glorified body of Christ, so that the church, the assembly of the baptized, is displayed as an extension of the Lord's body working in the world. For in one spirit we were all baptized into one body, whether Jews or Greeks, slaves or free persons, and we were all given to drink of one spirit. For to be free is not merely to cast off one's chains, but to live in a way that respects and enhances the freedom of others. Nelson Mandela